hopefully he can uh, pull that out in this game. HBox obviously known for his stupid good pressure game on uh, Fox. In general, obviously, but especially against Fox, he's known for that. Yeah, and, and Krim did a good job with his DI right there. The up tilt, he died straight up to land on the platform, so Hungrybox wasn't able to get a rest there. Yeah. So he has some sort of knowledge of the matchup. We see that. He's technically only behind by a little bit on percent. And he's actually up now. Yeah. But, you know, it's also one of those things you got to remember that, oh, Ooh, wow, yeah, red. red. Like, every time you have a, a top player against a player who's not, you know, not even, like, top one or whatever, yeah. it's always the same scenario, like, oh, wow, it was actually pretty close. And then game two, it's, like, a disaster for, you know, the other party. So it's like that That first, happens often. Right. So, you know, you got to remember, like, they're reading each other right now. And usually the top player is much quicker at it. Not counting Krim out at all, but just something to look out for, you know, look out for the... Uh, um, heavier reads coming out as uh, time progresses in the set here from Hungrybox and such. Okay, try to, trying to go for these down air uh, into different options, but not able to get them from Hungrybox. Oh my that goodness. That crazy combo game that we talked about during Hungrybox's last match, too. Yeah, yeah the, uh, like the weak forward air to back air, up air. Even the, he went like nair to up air. Like, I've never seen that. Yeah. That was gross. That's nice. Oh, the lowest of low back airs. It's those little mix-ups, though, that's so important. Especially a kill percent. That's oh, how yeah. you get those kills. Like, just that. So many Foxes will just run up and up smash, and it's so not safe, and it's just going to get punished. Right. Yeah, you can't do that. Like, you can run up, you know, jab up smash a lot safer, but, again, if you can mix it up and get that. Oh, not not a great position for Krim right now. Yeah. He gets the rest. That's it. He, he knew at that point, like. Oh, yeah, for sure. He knew what he was going for. Right, Krim Fox, at that point, Fox only has so many options. Right. More than most characters, but still only so many options. Right. Yeah, that's, that's it. it. Oh my goodness. I feel like Hungerbox has, he's almost like a heat seeking missile. He's just always right there with a leg. Yeah. He's <laughs> like, oh, you went down here, I'm going to go right there. Oh, you went up here, I'm going to go right there. At this point, it's rare, far and few between, that he messes up the spacing for those types of things. Yeah. Yeah, he's so on point for that. Like, it's crazy. It literally, again, looks like he's just homing right onto him. Like an automatic, just robot. All right, so FD, typical. Um, Fox, you know, one thing is like, uh, Puff is super good at getting those uh, platform tech chase rests and all that fun stuff, which HBox is super good against, so good at. Um, Oh, is that good? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, anytime Fox is off stage, you're gonna die against Hunger Yeah, Hunger Box definitely has the, the solid edge guards. Yeah, that's pretty much gonna be it. All right, so just Hunger Box just playing around Krim right now. Krim uh, trying to play a little. He's, I don't know. He's he's going a little more aggressive than he was last game, which is kind of costing him a bit here. Okay. He's trying to switch it up, but Krim is just getting uh, beat out Ooh. every time he whiffs. He wave dashed around him with that F smash. And it's been said before, Jigglypuff's F smash is really good. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, let's see if I can see on the screen. Oh, he gets right, a rest. Got rest. Yeah, we got this. No. Okay, we're back. And the rest punish. And the up smash. Yep. But HBox up three stocks to one right now. Oh, is this going to be the... Oh, I was oh a still going. Still going. 67% punish game. Yeah. With Puff, of course. Can't forget that. Oh. Interesting. Up air? He oh, he went for an F air for some reason. Uh, oh. Oh, wow, that was clutch. Oh, but he just lets him back on for free. You can't do that. No. Especially against Age Blocks. Yeah, like Krim is, he's getting a few hits here, but he's still getting too much percentage, especially since he's down uh, several stocks. Every time Hungrybox gets a hit, it's so much better for him than Krim, just because, again, he is up so much. Oh, that was close. <laughs> but like you said, just throwing out those up smashes, yeah, you like, you can't just throw out scary. up smashes. You have to be smart. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. That roll game, though. Oh, wow. Yeah. 
That's it. That is it. I, I'd like to say that's pretty classic uh, H-Box. All right, so with that being said, it's been fun hosting and commentating with you folks. Uh, I'm Zero the Thief. I'm Sai. We're going to sign off for our boys. Uh, I believe it's Schrader and Lizozzi about to hop on. So hope you guys enjoy their commentary. Feel free to give us some follows on Twitter if you'd like. I'm at Heist Zero. I'm at Nice Guy Sai. You guys have a blessed afternoon and enjoy the rest of CEO. Yeah. Yep. See ya.